Recently, I've hit 25,000 subscribers, and as promised, here is a QA. I don't know if it's worth doing one because I live stream a lot, and most of the questions you guys would want to ask would be asked there, and I would ask them already. But let's give it a go and see what you guys come up with. First question comes from Master Ash, who said, Please tell that why you are better than professional. Well, the main reason is because he is shit. Uh, most of you are better than a professional. You maybe just not know it. I've also got several world records to my name, including various speed runs on the Cape Rico, Diamond Casino Heist, Prison Break, to name a few. Um, most money taken ever out of the vault in the Diamond Casino at just under 6 million. And most money taken glitchless out of the casino at just under 4 million. Plus, all round gameplay. I'm just way better than he is, but so are you. Our next question is from AlexBoy99 awesome gaming a very catchy name there who asks will you answer this question no lifecycle asks what other games do you play besides gta 5 regularly i used to play gran turismo sports i got up to the top three percent i've also played the mass effect series uh the last of us part two which i've 100 percent completed god of war inside limbo loads of other games i don't just play gta 5 but it's the one that i'm most known for Ed Frost asks, what space movie was released in 1992? Well, having a quick look at IMDb, I found probably the greatest movie none of us have ever watched, which is called Gay N-Words from Outer Space. It has a 6 out of 10 rating. Pretty good for a movie that you've probably never heard of. Daniel Cook asks, dream car other than the Audi TT. I own an Audi TT Mark III. My dream car might be a Audi R8. It changes depending on my mood. I really like the Bentley Continental. A TT RS would be awesome. I'd like something relatively practical, but also looks good and has loads of speed. Nick Van Heeren asks, when did you start streaming for the first time and why? My very first live stream was on March 9th, 2020. The reason I started was because my world record diamond casino heist really started blowing up. So I thought I could capitalize on it and maybe get some more viewers. The reason I kind of started the channel was to document just various stuff that I enjoyed doing. I, my aim was never to become a YouTuber. It just kind of happened that way. But after that got popular, I thought I'd, um, oh, maybe I would start streaming. As you can see, 314 views was my very first one. Nine likes. I was just doing big comp preps, really. I wasn't even talking. But after that, I thought I'd take it semi-seriously. And uh, here we are. Toki Meji asks, are you going to buy expanded and enhanced? If so, why? I will be buying expanded and enhanced. As a GTA content creator, I kind of have to buy expanded and enhanced. Hopefully it will mean better all around gameplay and visuals, mostly for online, which is what I care about. But I probably will be doing a run of the story mode as well. And as a content creator, mainly known for GTA, you have to stay with the times in order to stay relevant. Daniel Cook asks, favorite non-alcoholic drink and favorite alcoholic drink? Non-alcoholic, I like flavored coffees and also J2Os. Alcoholic drink, as many of you know that watch the live streams, will be Jack Daniels and Coke. Isaac Liu asks, what keeps you playing GTA Online? Arguably the greatest game ever made with regards to online because of its longevity as well as free content that Rockstar keep giving us. Although lately after the uh, Tuners DLC, it has become a bit stale for me. But as soon as there's new stuff, I will be back playing the game more regularly. Regularly, 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 regularly. Bad Influence for Children asks, You ever get orb? I'm guessing it means, have I ever been orbed? Or do I ever get orbed? I got orbed just the other day. Uh, me and a friend were beating up some assholes in GTA Online. One of them left, came back a few minutes later, and orbed me. If you are one of those orb players, all you're showing everyone that plays the game is that you suck. Zed Soggy HD asks, Happy birthday, Beats. Sorry I couldn't make the stream today. Hope you had a great day and hope to see you streaming again. Not a question, but thanks anyway. Daniel Cook, again, asks, Hypothetically, if you went to prison for one thing, what would it be? Seeing as the job I have means I cannot have any criminal record, I have to keep myself very clean indeed, which is what I have done throughout my entire life. If I were to go to prison, it would probably be for speeding. Nerve Illusion asks, are you planning on streaming any other online games? I have previously streamed The Last of Us Part 2, Mass Effect, Shadow of the Colossus, which is the worst game ever made. I'm sure there's a few others there. Uh, Grand Tourism is what I've done. But the views are just simply not worth doing. That's why I don't do it. Everyone knows me for my GTA content, so most people don't give a shit about any, anything else that I might be playing. I have considered doing the South Park game, as I think it'd be pretty funny to play along with. So stay tuned for that if I decide to. And the last question for now is from Tatwick, who asks, do you have a girlfriend? 
I wouldn't consider her a girlfriend, but I was seeing her last year, just before Christmas. And uh, we recently got back together, kind of. We now work at the same place, which is weird. I'm not one for girlfriends, to be honest. I'm very difficult to get on with. I have extremely high standards. I do like to argue, which isn't a great trait to have when you want a relationship. And I'm simply happy enough being on my own, so it's never really bothered me. So there it is, 25,000 subscribers Q&A. If you enjoyed it, leave a like. If you didn't, leave a like anyway. Look out for more new content coming soon, and I'll see you in the next one.